Welcome back. Well, Fox 41 and the Colorado Springs Independent are teaming up once again for this year's Give campaign. We're highlighting local organizations that need your help. Now, this morning we're speaking with the Catamount Institute, who, who encourages kids to get outside and learn. We've got Chris Obi with us, as well as Noah and Connor. Good morning. Thank you guys so much for being here. Good morning. Thank you so much for having us. Absolutely. Today. So tell us a little bit about the Catamount Institute. What do you guys do? What are you all about? Sure. Our mission is to develop ecological stewards through education and adventure, which pretty much boils down to we want to change kids lives through incredible outdoor educational experiences so we do this through summer camps in the summer during the school year we're teaching in the classroom but then also outside and field trips um, we're headquartered in a local park called Sonderman Park it's a beautiful hundred acre oasis just minutes from downtown and we see about 8,000 kids a year through all of our programs oh my gosh that's a lot so is it kids from just all over the region then, the Pikes Peak region? Exactly, the whole Pikes Peak region. We have uh, an after school club that reaches all the way to Cripple Creek, all the way to Lake George, uh, down to security, up to Black Forest. But then our field trip program will even bring in kids from Denver, from Canyon City and Pueblo will come up here to experience the outdoors that Colorado Springs has to offer. Wow, that is so special. So how do people get involved? I mean, do you guys pay for all this stuff for these kids? Right, so there are some fees for some of our our programs but we really the hardest thing I would ever have to do is tell a child no right. you don't get to go outside right. so we have a really robust scholarship program our after-school club is really focused on getting low-income schools and low-income uh, children outside uh, because not everybody gets that opportunity in Colorado Springs and sometimes we forget because we live so close to the outdoors everyone thinks everyone in Colorado Springs gets outside every day right. and not all kids get that opportunity absolutely but Noah and Connor, you guys have gotten that opportunity. So tell me a little bit about, we'll start with you. What have you, what have you done with this institute? Well, I have done four camps oh. um, in the summer. And I take a lot of hikes in Catamount. And it's kind of like a good getaway yeah. from all the electronics these days. Yeah, that's for <laughs> sure. Kids are definitely glued to the phones and tablets. What about you, Connor? How, how um, has this helped you? It's helped me um, understand the, um, how nature can grow and um, how it will keep growing. Yeah, definitely. Definitely a good learning experience for these kids, for sure. You know, as you said, people are a lot of the times on their tablets, not getting outdoors, recess times getting shorter, things like that. So how have you seen the kids involved in this program change or grow? We see it all the time and we get feedback from teachers all over the community that students that may have trouble in the classroom or have a hard time concentrating, when they're outside doing science lessons or math lessons, they can concentrate so much better and behavior issues start to go away. So there are a lot of studies out there that show how time outdoors for children can really improve both um, education and academic performance, but also physical health and also mental health. Absolutely. So you guys have a couple different programs that people can get involved in. And of course, you can find that on our website. And this is for the Give Campaign. So if you'd like to help out kids like Noah and Connor here, get outside. You can go to our website, fox21news.com, and donate to help out the Cat Catamount Institute. Again, thank you guys so much for being here and telling us a little bit about your program. It seems like it's helping a lot of people for sure. Thank you. Absolutely. All right, Maddie, let's take another look at that weekend forecast.